I invented the shape mask and uh, it's one of those circumstances where you're working with a shoestring budget, you just have almost no money to work with. So there was no question of doing what you would do if you had enough time and money, which is okay, sculpt a face, sculpt a mask, do a mold, uh, prototype, try it out, modify it, blah, blah, blah. No, I had to go out, go shopping, find a likely blank face type mask because that's what the script was asking for and uh, adapt it in some way. Well, obviously, Tommy, you don't have superpowers. You can't see into the future at this time, but now a mask that you created is pretty much the most popular mask in the world. It's on shelves. It's pretty much the face of Halloween. How does that feel for you? <laughs> Just being a monster kid and now like you have the monster mask. I like to say that the feelings are mixed. I'm, I'm delighted and proud of all of that. I'd be even happier if I was making a little money on the thing. I had a penny for every mask that was out there. I'd probably be able to send my grandchildren to college. But that's the way it goes. You know, right. I, I am proud of it and very pleased that uh, we could never have dreamed uh, of the phenomenon that Halloween created. 